I met my wife actually twice. The first time was when we were both at the Royal Melbourne Hospital. She was a trainee nurse and I was uh, training in the nuclear medicine department. And eight or nine years later, we met in my lounge room. I've been living in Maroondah for 35 years. Uh, we uh, moved here in 1985 and uh, that was Ringwood. A significant life event that shaped me would certainly be uh, probably marriage um, and children because from that point on uh, that's formed everything that uh, everything that we do is around family and children. I, I think your parents instill certain things into you that uh, uh, you can build on. I think the uh, passionate event in my life probably is music because uh, from a, a very early age I've been involved with music now for nearly, uh, well, 60, 60 years really. Uh, I'm mainly with the U3A now, now I've, I've retired from, I used to, I've been playing in bands and choirs and orchestras uh, over the years. Uh, we played in the Karalika Theatre for many, many years. My main involvement in Maroondah is uh, U3A, um, University of the Third Age. I spend a lot of time with that group. I, I run their website. I'm also a tutor for uh, a computer uh, course. And also I uh, participate in music uh, um, in the group as well. University of Third Age is uh, p retired people sharing the skills that they've learnt while they were working with other people so we can learn other skills other than what we uh, were involved with just as, as working people. The Maroondah community is, uh, it's really, it's, uh, it's got everything here. Uh, every facility that you want uh, is in Ringwood and um, I think that's what I like about it. It's, it's got everything I need as a retired person. Probably I'm very um, keen on volunteering. I think that's the way of the future. We don't get paid for what we do, but we enjoy it. It's a social thing. I think what I'm, I'm really proud of is that I've got skills that I can share with, with people. In the, in the area that we live, Maroondah Council have been very supportive of, of U3A and uh, the facilities in this area are fantastic. So older people are very lucky.